welcome to the channel talk about tech and coding here so please subscribe i was just editing a video and boom this happened so this is basically what happened watch watch my screen boom it just closed and you know what i hadn't saved my work and i was editing a very important video for my other channel and how to green where i do unboxing of items so how do you go ahead and recover a video when your shortcut video editor crashes right we reason why most a lot of people use shortcuts is because it's totally free of charge to use and it's lighter on the system like if you are using an adobe adobe premiere pro or a davinci on a system that does not have a dedicated uh, memory you will have a lot of issues but shortcuts is a is an open source free video editor that enables you to edit videos easily and you know it's packed with a whole lot of things that you have to pay for in other products so how do you go ahead to restore your shortcut after the the software crashed shortcut crashed when i opened it again this was what i had all right and when i tried opening this there's the under the list of um items that i had I, I saw one that had the name of the project i was working on unboxing the wireless lavalier mic from aliexpress this was what it's, it's giving me it's giving me this white stuff there is really nothing here i can't work with this i still advise you to keep saving your work once you create your project save it and maybe after every five minutes you save your work but if you have this kind of situation come over to this place settings under menu scroll down all right scroll down to app data recovery all right you can this is a set that is not what we want here you can see this show click on show so what it's going to do is going to open this folder for you for me it's under this pc and of course i'm using a windows system windows 11 if it's a lesser windows it's most likely going to be the same thing if you're using mac please check the address on yours so see under my main pc under the local drive users my name here that's the user update local um melty tech then shortcut so this is where this folder is located so you can see this shortcut folder you see this auto save here all right so shortcut is actually auto saving your stuff as you work might not give you one you know how auto save works it takes it saves at intervals right so you have to try and be saving your stuff but in case your work crashes at least you can recover a very a reasonable amount of your work from this you can see the kind of names here they are very they are strings of you know alphanumeric stuff here but what i'm looking for here is the dates and time when I was working on this project. Now, if you see, I have some projects from November, you know, and all those things here. November, this is all the way from September. But this work, I was doing it on the 19th of December, 2022. So you can see this is the only work I have here on this date. So this is 19 December, 2022, and this is 9.30 a.m. So this is the only item here that seems to be what i was working on so all i have to do here is double click it and shortcuts is going to open this and you can see my work is back yes i was working on this and it's really tried as much as possible to get me all the items that i had in this project are here the editings i've done like the cutting the pasting the uh, layers and whatever i had in this shortcut project they are here and of course i've provided link in case you're interested in this project i was working on for my other youtube channel there is a link to it in the description panel so you can see the review of this product all i need to do now is to save this project so as not to lose it so i'm going to save this I'll come over to my file menu here and i go to save us now of course we locate the folder where i was working on this rename this file dot mlt mlt is the file format for shortcut video editor can now save 
I cannot comfortably work with this knowing that it's saved. So another thing we can look at before we go is, you know, when we came to this app data recovery, there is this set and the show. Show is for you to see the app recovery. Well, what is this set? So I'm going to click on this set. It says you need to restart shortcut to change the data recovery. Do you want to continue? I'll click yes. What is happening here is that it's going to, it's asking me where I want to save my auto saves. All right. So I'm just still going to select the same auto save folder and I'll do this. So yeah, now shortcut has restarted. So all that this is, is for you to select the folder where shortcut should be saving auto saving your files okay so that's really what this means so once you click on yes it will ask you for a folder so for example if i want to save it to my desktop or just any other folder but for me i'm comfortable with where it is currently I like the fact that it's quite hidden please hit on the subscribe button if you find this helpful in any way please subscribe to the channel i bring you tech stuff here tech reviews and tech videos most times i teach how to program or solve programming problems here if you find this video valuable in any way please hit that like button so that youtube can recommend it to other people and of course subscribe to the channel so that you can get more of my content oh before i forget you can follow me on my social media handles at anasutech thank you again and bye for now